What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another Minecraft video and today is the start of a new series of mine called How to Run Your Own Minecraft Server. Now uh, basically what this series is going to teach you guys is uh, some of the basic tips and tricks of running your own Minecraft server, some of the commands, how to really have fun and uh, run your server smoothly and efficiently. So that's what this series is going to be about. And look out for uh, my video coming out at the end of this week on how to make your own Minecraft server. Uh, be looking for that. Annotation will be up shortly and the video will be up within the week. So check that out when that is out. Uh, so right now we're going to get into one of the most basic commands and uh, one of the most actually important commands of running your own Minecraft server and that is uh, OP or making someone an admin. Now what basically an admin is is someone who uh, basically has the same power as you. They can type in these commands, they can uh, set the time, they can basically help out uh, run the server and make it run smoothly. So that is very helpful, especially if you have a larger server. So to do this, you're gonna type in T, which brings up the chat box, and you're gonna type in backslash. Now, backslash is really important because every command that um, that you are gonna use starts with backslash. It bas it's basically telling the computer to say, oh, the backslash indicates that a command is coming up next. So very important. So backslash op, and then the username, uh, the name of the user that you want to op. My name is Mzla. <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna opt myself, and there we go. So now an admin, I can do all the commands. I can help run whoever's server, which is, this is my server, but whoever else's server I become an admin of, and uh, which is very helpful. But if someone is not being very nice or abusing their power as an admin, you can de-admin them. So we're gonna type T, bring up the chat box, backslash, and we're gonna type in D-E-O-P, which is D-O-P, and the name of the naughty user who is using their admin powers improperly. Now when I click enter, I am now not an admin anymore. Now if I tried to re-op myself, I would not be able to do it. As you see right there, you do not have permission to use this command because I am not an admin. Now, if somehow uh, this happens to you and uh, you're the you, uh, like like me, you rent, you're running your own server. Somehow you uh, deopt yourself and you can't reopt yourself again, and no one else can reopt you because you didn't admin anyone yet else yet. Uh, I'm going to show you a trick on how to do that. So yeah, if you somehow accidentally deopt yourself and there's somehow no other way for you uh, to get uh, re-opted or become another administrator, then this is the way to do it. You're going to open up your server box and this is basically what is running uh, your Minecraft server and holds a lot of information. This basically tells you uh, what is going on in your server. So as you can see, you can see when people joined, uh, you see when I opted myself and when I de-opted myself. So all commands pop up here. Uh, you'll see when people die, when people, uh, basically anything what that the, the computer will tell you uh, is right here. So. With this, we're going to type in slash op like we just did in Minecraft, and we're going to type in the player that we want to admin, which is Mzala, which is me. <laughs> so we're going to opt myself, press enter. We're going to minimize this, go back to Minecraft, and you can see in the bottom left-hand corner, the server says opted Mzavala. So now I'm an admin. I can opt myself or whatever. I can uh, do all the, the admin commands that uh, app admins can do. And so this is a really helpful tip if somehow you uh, de out yourself, someone, I don't know, maybe someone typed it in on your computer when you're uh, on it. Somehow something happened and you cannot opt yourself. You will have to go into your Minecraft server box and do it through that way. And this Minecraft server box is extremely helpful because uh, you don't have to be in Minecraft to actually give these commands because you're the one who's running the server you can type these commands in from here and they go straight into the server. So that's really nice and uh, really helpful. So there we go. That is uh, how to opt someone, how to make someone an admin on a Minecraft server. So yeah, that's it. Hope you all enjoyed and please like and subscribe and uh, stay with it on this series because videos will be coming out very fast and very soon. Look out for my next video about uh, how to make your own Minecraft server that will be coming out shortly. And my next command video, which will probably be about how to change the game mode of your Minecraft server, which is another helpful tool. And so thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoy it and I'll talk to you all later.